The first time I saw paintings and poems created by artificial intelligence, I felt both shocked and depressed. Does this mean that humanity's and art's essence of human civilization will gradually degenerate in the future? It's going to change because um, many things that people thought are uniquely human, only humans can do it and computers will never be able to do it. Now we realize, oh, computers are actually uh, capable, even better than humans. So we thought that uh, computers can't drive cars and now they can drive cars. We thought they can't defeat humans in chess or go and now they are better than humans in chess and go. And like the last line of defense, is art and creativity. And people said computers will never be able to create art and to be creative. But this isn't true. Uh, computers are becoming better in some respects than humans, even when it comes to artistic creation mm -hmm. and to creativity in general. I think what really makes the difference between a human and an AI is not a particular ability like the ability to drive or uh, uh, the ability to compose music. What really makes the difference is the issue of consciousness. Computers are becoming better than humans when it comes to intelligence, but computers don't have any consciousness and they don't seem to be developing any consciousness. There is a lot of confusion about this. People confuse intelligence with consciousness. Uh, intelligence is the ability to solve problems, even the problems of composing music. You can say, oh, this is a problem, you need intelligence to do it. So this is intelligence solving problems. Consciousness is the ability to feel things, to feel pain or pleasure or love or hate or whatever. In humans, intelligence and consciousness go together. We solve problems by feeling things. But in computers, they don't go together. There is an amazing development of computer intelligence, but zero development so far of computer consciousness. So I don't think computers will be anything like humans in the, in the near or even in the medium future, mm -hmm. uh, because you always have this uh, basic gap. And therefore, I also think that humans should invest not in trying to compete with computers in intelligence, developing their intelligence. I think humans should instead focus on developing their consciousness. Mm -hmm. As far as I know, you don't use smartphones yourself. Why not? Can I interpret this as your alertness and the resistance to new technology? I don't resist new technology. I don't think you can stop the march of technology and, and we shouldn't try to because technology has so many advantages also. But I think we should control technology and use it for our purposes instead of being controlled by it and being used by it for its purposes. And um, for me as a scholar, one of the dangers now is that people are flooded with too much information uh, and they don't have the peace and quiet and time to tell the difference between what is important what is unimportant, and to take all the information and make a meaningful picture of the world out of it. So in order to uh, maintain my peace and quiet and attention and the ability to focus and to go deeply into the subject, um, I try to limit this flood of information, of irrelevant information. And one of the ways to do it is not to have a smartphone. Uh, in addition, uh, my husband has a smartphone, mm -hmm. so uh, uh, he gets all this flood of information. So it's not completely true that uh, I don't use it, I just let somebody else use it for me. Mm -hmm. Talk about yourself, very important. How come at such a young age have gained such a profound insight into society, science, technology and philosophy? Does it have anything to do with your profession or city where you live? I don't think so. Uh, <laughs> uh, I, I don't really have a, a good answer. I just, you know, follow the questions that interest me. And it happened to be that these questions interest so many other people. So that they, they, they want to hear what I have to say about it. Mm -hmm. But I don't think there is any special method or secret that I can explain it. Mm -hmm.